hi guys welcome back to my channel if you are a new subscriber hi welcome to my channel my name is life of giovanna and i just post some random crazy videos sometimes today's episode y'all must be thinking like what in the world why is she putting on video like that you guys it has been working for me and if anyone loves to go to the gym with makeup on and people look at you like you're going to the gym to sweat it off like why are you doing that girl i have a solution for you a mask now if you're not about the mask then this video is not for you but if it helps anyone else that you might know hey shoot them down the video but anyways this has been working for me just because of my lower face been breaking out like crazy i have pigmentation where it looks like dang girl yeah your face is breaking out no girl it's i have freckles on top of acne scarring and it just makes my face look like i'm having a panic attack and now or even if you have errands to run and you don't want to you want to look put together but not really this is my son's mask that's what i'm using it because i don't have one up here of myself mine my own so clearly the mask covers up to here so literally i look like i'm all dolled up but in reality when they take the mask off ah! <laughs> don't forget to like comment and subscribe and hit the little bell so you don't miss a new video without further ado let's get straight into this video okay guys we are going to i'm going to show you guys how pretty much what works for me um currently through my excuse my bed my bed's not made i literally just came back from dropping my daughter off so i rolled out of bed my son was laying with me somehow he ended up in my bed this morning don't ask me why and how or what time i don't know he's just any mamas out there that their kids do the same thing like i don't know what it is with my bed okay so first and foremost i'm gonna start off with the morphe uh pomade i am just gonna my eyebrows are kind of already dark but i kind of like to fill them in a bit um just because i do have some bald spots in between my brows for when i was younger um it was just that yes i guess you can say always bumping myself into something so i'm just gonna fill that in so my bald spots are right here and then up here where I don't grow no hair. Like, I don't know what happened to it. I don't know what happened to it, who happened to it, where she went. And then I like to just brush it out. So now, <clears throat> now that I did both eyebrows, wait, <laughs> I forgot to spoolie this out. <clears throat> Excuse me. So now that I spoolie it out, so it comes with the hair in here. I have recently been into this, um this elf 16 hour camel concealer it's a matte finish and i think i messed up just because this one is does dry super super fast this is really good elf 16 hour con com um camel 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 concealer and what i personally like to do or what's i don't know what works for me is i grab this right here the brush and i put it right underneath my line and I go with the concealer all the way across the brow. And the brush that I'm using, it's from MAC. I don't think they have it in stock anymore. But honestly, you can use any brush that works for you. This is the one that I like. After that, you might see it might dry a little bit. Yeah, you see? Look at how fast it dries. But this one, you have to really work with it super, super fast, like in the moment. You cannot let it sit there and chit chat. And then I go in with the other e.l.f., also the 16 hour. It is in the color medium neutral. I feel like this one matches my skin so perfect. It's so crazy. Cause there are some that don't match you. And it's like, ugh. So then I just do the same thing that I did to the top. So then I grab a little bit on the rim and I go up and down, I sweep up and down and then I sweep in. Anyway, so my eyebrows are done. That's the way they came out. Okay, so now for the face, I am going to put just a little bit of primer and that's underneath here, the eyes. Just because you understand what I know. What I've been noticing is that um, 
not putting washing my face with soap or any lotion putting any lotion on my face has been working for me you guys and when i say like my face has stopped breaking out like i normally would have every day like a big old pimple you know and um the eyelashes that i'm going to use today i am actually going to start selling them um i'm gonna get back into the lash business and whatnot so i finally found a um a distributor that i can work with and i ultimately love these lashes just because you guys look at they are mint so what i like to do is if you are a newbie and you do not know how to put on eyelashes i always suggest to cut the end and the beginning just because that stuff does really engrave into your eye and then the glue that i'm currently using is duo this is my ultimate favorite you guys you guys can find this at walmart and put it on the lash band and what i've been loving is this trick because i always used to put on my lashes but then throughout the day i would find out that my lash my full lash band was not intact with my reel then so then i i found this new technique so anyway so i'm gonna i'm gonna put lash glue on on my skin where my lashes or my strip lash is gonna go not on top of your lashes you guys do not put it on top of your lashes this glue is so good it'll even stay on your skin tell my nice son he's over in the corner watching his ipad my grandma said to go get some cuckoos okay so now that i did that so i'm going i'm using actually the Ma the maybelline the colossal big shot mascara it looks like this so i like to just apply just a little bit of mascara on my real lashes just so that my real la my lash band and my real lashes blend in together so it kind of looks like they are my real lashes so now i'm going to be using this um little utensil thingy if you do have tweezers you can also use the tweezers but i feel like this works so much better for me um so then you wait till the glue gets tacky and you don't really like if you stick your finger barely like that and it's sticky then they're ready for you to put on so i gotta find out which one's which i think this one okay so the t the trick so the trick is for you to look down and apply as close as you can to your lash line. Right? As close as to your lash line as possible. Just push in the lash so it is all in. And if you have uh, f uh, nails, it's even harder for you to do that, but this is what works for me. That's why I love when I don't have lashes. I mean, nails, lashes. Girl! And then what I like to do, so remember, when I did put the glue on, I, on my lash line, now you're gonna grab your two fingers and get the bottom of your lash, your lashes and the top of your skin and clench them in together. All the way around. And if you were to look down, look. It kind of looks like, looks like it's coming from your, like these are your lashes. That's why I really like an excuse if there's like any white on it. It's probably the glue, but. Okay, now the next part that I'm going to do is I'm going to be grabbing the same concealer that I used to conceal the top of my brows. And I'm going to put it on my eyelids. That is why I said um, that we're just going to conceal not conceal we're gonna prime just the bottom of our lashes i mean <laughs> we're gonna prime underneath our eyes and i'm using the elf concealer in the color medium neutral and i just put like a few dots and then i go with the beauty blender remember you gotta work fast because if not it'll mess you up voila and then next i'm going to be grabbing my setting powder i've been trying this revolution um setting powder and i am got to tell you girls this is such a good affordable setting powder 
um i had rant not rant out but i wanted to try a different one i was trying the cat Mondi and then the other one i can't seem to remember where it's at and then with another beauty blender you're just gonna set the underneath eyes with that setting powder from revolution i absolutely absolutely love it they do come in different shades um the, the one the shade that i got was uh, apparently not i guess banana and then i'm gonna go in with my mascara okay you guys so now that i'm done with my eye portion of my eye i'm done I'm completely done. This is the way I do my makeup when I, this is actually how I do my makeup every single day just because I do go to the gym four days a week. And I, if you're a female that doesn't like um, to wear makeup to the gym, but you still wanna look cute. And nowadays, since we have to wear a mask, it kind of doesn't really matter um a mask will cover this part and i don't put makeup here just because again i am breaking out a lot and um it's not the makeup because i've been using this makeup for so long you know and i just feel like lately i don't know if it's my iud that's making me break out a lot or if it's a certain thing that i'm eating but i have been cutting out uh, not having Starbucks, so I don't know if my face is getting better or if it was the the stuff that I use on my face. And I have been using the Nivea um, Soft Body and Face Cream. It smells so good, but I feel like having scents and put on, putting it on your face is not good for your skin, especially if you have sensitive skin. And then what I wash my face with normally is the Lever 3000 or 2000. I don't know what it is, but I'll insert a picture here. I'll let you know what I pretty much the bar soap that I use. And I've completely stopped using it since my sister told me, I think it was since Saturday. I seen her on Saturday and she has an issue too where she just breaks out like right here. And she's like, I literally stopped washing my face and putting anything on my face and my face has cleared up. So i'm going to go see the doctor today so let's see what happens and what she tells me hopefully there's a remedy or something she can get me because a girl is over breaking out anyways you guys thank you guys so much for watching and if you stayed till the very end let's change and then we'll come back leave me a comment down below you guys i've been saying that in the past video that nobody leaves a comment <laughs> just kidding no but you guys leave me down comments and like if you guys really with me like that then leave me a comment down below let me know what you guys want to see more of whether it be challenges pranks you know whatever it is i mean i have pranks that i'm trying to pull up my sleeve but i want to hear from you guys you know because you guys you guys are my audience and i have to kind of put some stuff out that you guys want to see more of but before i go y'all <laughs> let's do a little outfit check this is for the gym the gym the gym the gym the gym, the gym. Isn't this so cute? I got this little cute set. Was it last week? Yeah, last week. And I love it. It just, like you guys, I'm so fascinated with this suit. I got like five of them, but I'm super excited about it. But anyways, you know what? A little quick tip. If you want to get straight into the gym, you want to motivate yourself, buy yourself a bunch of outfits and I promise you, It'll get your butt going and wanting to go to the gym to show off the cute outfits. Thank you so much for watching. And I forgot to record an outro, but don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and hit that bell so you don't miss a video. And I'll see you guys on my next one. Bye, guys.